Now, there's a reason why you might be dizzy all the time, and today I'm going to tell you what it is. That could be the signs of dehydrated. You have to know your thirst, your urine color, how often you're taking a piss, what are your energy levels like, and mental clarity. So first, I'm going to start off with the story where we had such an amazing May. And usually May is a little bit colder, and I usually kind of just slowly integrate myself back into tennis, but this May was extremely hot. And with the heat, I wasn't prepared because when it's cold outside or when it's dark outside, you're not as thirsty. And so thirst is something that you kind of build yourself up to. And it's also something that you can build yourself out to. So I was just focused on playing, playing, playing. I'd play one hour, two hours, no problems. But then I would forget that I need to be matching the amount of fluids to the amount that I'm sweating. And when I'm outside, my body isn't used to sweating that much. And so it probably over like, released fluids and as such it increased my dehydration levels and by the end of the day and the next day I felt like my brain was fogged I felt like I was getting a headaches and in fact I was feeling dizzy and so today I want to give you the explanation and indicators of you being dehydrated so number one is thirst the thing that you have to understand is that if you are thirsty you are dehydrated. So if you're like, oh, I need a little bit of water, I need a drink or something like that, guess what? You're already dehydrated. So at that point, you need to overhydrate and hyperhydrate. I would recommend to drink 500 mLs of water right away. The thing that you can also do is pick up EAAs. The EAAs that we sell at the gym, they have electrolytes in them. They taste great. It makes drinking water much easier and there's a ton of benefits in there that will help you with your muscles if you want to know more about EAAs search in the fit club channel on YouTube and there you'll see a video where I talked all about EAAs the second thing of dehydration is your urine color now it should never be completely clear because if it's clear there's a good chance that you're flushing out electrolytes so if it's crystal clear that doesn't necessarily mean that you're in a good hydration state it could mean that you're overhydrated now, if it's a dark yellow and you haven't taken any supplements that have any dyes in them, then there's a good chance that you're dehydrated. So what you want to look for is like a lemon iced tea color. So like a light yellow. Third is how often are you taking a piss? Okay. If you're going every one to two hours, then you're in good shape. You don't want to hold fluids in your body for too long. You want your body constantly flushing, right? Your body should be constantly regenerating itself based on how much movement you're doing, the food that you're eating, and then like the rest of your life that you're walking around or working or whatever it is, your body needs to recirculate and regenerate. And so as such, if you're going to the washroom every one to two hours, you're actually in good shape. It doesn't mean that you have a bladder issue or it might, I don't know. But according to the research that I found that one to two hours is that optimal time to make sure that you are taking in enough fluids. And the last but not least is your energy levels and mental clarity. So if you're feeling bogged down, guess what? You don't need another coffee because you're probably dehydrated and the caffeine acts as a makes you take a piss. And so it'll actually make you more dehydrated. So instead of reaching for a coffee to wake you up, maybe you actually need to de decrease the amount of caffeine that you're taking to allow your receptors to regenerate so that no you're not always producing the sleepy hormones. But you can swap out your coffee and try adding lemon and stevia if you're doing fasting so that the lemon juice and the stevia doesn't break your fast. Or like we talked about earlier in this video, you can add EAAs to your water, which makes water that much better. It's adding electrolytes and it's helping you build muscle. So there we have it guys, dehydration, it is a thing and it could be the one thing that's creating dizziness in your life and potentially migraines. So you make sure that you're never thirsty, that your urine color is that nice lemon yellow, that you're going to the washroom every one to two hours, that's fine. And your energy levels plus your mental clarity is not affected. You can see straight, you can concentrate, and you don't feel bogged down. So there we have it, guys. Make sure that you give this video a like, hit the subscribe button, and if you're looking to get started with Fit Club and you're learning to get educated, you're looking to lose some weight, get into great shape, go to our website, www.fitclub.fit, hit the Get Started button, and we'll get you started today.